Welcome back, welcome back. It is me, The Brit Reacts, and today we are reacting to Billy the Joel, Billy Joel himself, scenes from an Italian restaurant. Let's see about that. All right, they love it. A bottle of whites bottle of red Perhaps a bottle of rosé And say We'll get a table near the street In our old familiar place You and I Face to face mm -hmm. A bottle of red mm -hmm. All right Clearly, I'm on the Billy Joel train. Like, is it clear? Because if it isn't, I'm on the train. <laughs> I also had a blue airhead earlier, so yeah. Oops. Um, I am head over heels for this guy. I just think he's like a world-renowned artist. Like, I just feel like he's capable of everything. Um, and you guys just keep dropping off suggestions. So I'm like, well, why not? Why not? Why not just choo-choo? Come on, ride a train. Come ride it, choo-choo. Um, I, I, I enjoy it. Clearly, this is a song about, like, a scenes from an Italian restaurant. You know, it feels like Little Italy in New York. He's like a bottle of red, a bottle of white, a bottle of rosé. If anyone wants to know, I'm a rosé girl. I am. I love a chilled rosé. Um, but yeah, I mean, set in the scene. And I, again, I think that all of his music just means more than just like music and entertainment. All of his music feels like something more. And even this, 43 seconds in, feels like something more. A bottle of white. Look at his fingers. It all depends upon your appetite. I'll meet you anytime you want in our Italian restaurant. Oh, yeah, that's me. I'm playing the fake, the air key. This is a big event, too. There's people everywhere. the sexiest instrument of them all is the saxophone. The saxophone, if you will. I said it. Oops. Um, I feel like we're on like a date night. Like we're, we're intruding on this couple's date night. He really is the people's artist, right? Like he makes songs for everybody. The lover, the activist. Like he truly makes music for all. And that's why I think I've dubbed him the people's artist. Like, I just, you know, like, why are we singing about this? Because someone has experienced it or someone wants to experience it and wants to hear music about it. That's why. Things are okay with me these days. I got a good job. I got a good office. Got a new life. Got a new life and the family is fine. We lost such a long ago. We lost weight. But look so nice after so much time Do you remember those days hanging out at the village green? Woo! The engineer boots and the jackets and tight blue jeans Oh, look at his drummer! So we're really, is that, is that the saxophone is now playing something else? How do you get back there so fast? Hold on, y'all, I have to readjust my chair. I, got, I don't know how I got so far away. I got up to get some water, and maybe I just didn't scoot my chair in enough. That's the, that's the sexy saxophonist, the sexy saxophonist guy. And now he's playing, what's that, the oboe? I think that's an oboe. Is that an oboe? And then his drummer, this cute girl in her, I think that's a Met jersey, I think I saw in her afro, and she's going to town on the, the Congo drums. Like, music, 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 music. Oh, I just hit my elbow, Jesus. 
Um, okay, so am I to understand that this song is literally different scenes? So like we're gonna get different tempos, different like feels for every scene. So every verse is a different scene. People's champ, not just the people's artist, the people's the people's champ. You hear me? This man can really play these instruments. Oh, her jersey says Joel on the bag. Okay, scene three. Ooh. 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 Tinkle the tinky, tink, the tink, tink. So what is it, tinkle the keys? Y'all, somebody told me in the comments recently, and I now I still can't remember. Tickle the keys. He's tickling something else, not just the keys. How does he play the piano like this? Jesus. Unreal. That's unbelievable. He's in the king and the queen of the farm. Okay. Riding around with the car top down and the radio on. Nobody looks any finer. So we go all ahead of the parkway down. We never knew we could want more than that out of life. Surely, Brenda and Eddie would only know how to survive. Oh, 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 can you tell how much I love that? I mean, I picked it up instantly. Whoa, whoa. All right, so I think he said Brenda and Billy. Is that what he said? Anyway, now we've got a couple in our scene three. Scene three, action. Brenda and Eddie were still going steady in the summer of 75. When the sign of the night would be in the end of July. Everyone said they were crazy. Crazy to get married? Eddie could never afford to live that kind of life. Is there a movie to go along with this or something? I feel like I should be watching scenes like of this being acted out. This feels like literally different New York City scenes, like different people's lives in New York City. And they are they all meeting at this little Italian restaurant in Little Italy? Oh, I love it here. I love it here. Well, got an apartment with deep on conference, on a baby to see us. They go to bed, they the breath, they for a couple of years. Here he is again. Is he running between the two places? Oh my lord. A Billy Joel concert seems like so much fun. Okay. Can never go back there again. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. I'm like out of breath for everyone on stage. It's, it's, there's a lot of energy. Um, dang, I need, this was in 2008. Is he still touring? I love to see Billy Joel in person. The energy is electrifying, truly. And it, it, it like literally comes off of everyone on the stage, not just Billy. Like you can tell they all really love him. They love his music. Like they love their job. Like you feel that. You really can feel when the the supporting cast enjoys what they're doing versus not. You know, they're just there for a paycheck. These people want to be here. 
Look, he's tired. I'm tired. Oh, it's in the end of the show for the rest of their lives. Oh, it's in the end of the greases. Best they can do is pick up their pieces. We always do that with the final way to get by. This song is really bad. It's like triple time. Wave them goodbye. Wave and Brenda and Eddie goodbye. Where are they going? Brenda, Eddie, come back. Oh, his piano is turning. So much going on. I'm so glad it slowed down because it, it was the pace. Like he really, he like went like this or like he was like wiping off, like just trying to catch his breath and wipe the sweat off. And it's like, no, you deserve to do that. Cause it, it, I feel tired. Like I was just running on a treadmill, like inclined sprints and you know what I mean? It was just like, whoa, well, it felt like the song was in fast forward. So I'm glad we've got a little tempo change, a lot, a big tempo change. Uh, it seems like we're going to slow down. Are we saying goodbye to Brendan and Eddie? Is this song to a new story? Sounds like it. Brendan and Eddie were chaotic. So maybe that's why their story was so like. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, Look how much fun everybody's having. They're just happy. The Oh, we're back there. Ooh, a bottle of white. Give me my rosé. Whatever kind of mood you're in tonight. Tonight. I'll meet you anytime you want in our Italian restaurant. Here he comes. He's back. Baby making music, y'all. You know, Billy the Goat, not the actual goat, but like the greatest of all time, Billy the Goat. I call uh, Bill, uh, wow, I can't remember his name. The comedian, why can't I think of his name? Bill Burr. I used to call him Billy the Goat too uh, when I used to react to him. Where's Where's he been lately? Is there something new I should be reacting to with Bill? Let me know, friends. Um, the stamina of everyone on that stage, just the the everything that that was that was a lot that was a lot I enjoyed it I, it just is it like supersedes entertainment like I said and it does it strikes a chord there's some there's some like there's just something there and I get the stadium being completely sold out and people just losing it and just like having like if it, it felt like people were having like this like outer body experience because I feel like that's the type of artist that he is like it's not just a he's not just a musical artist and it's not just a musical experience it's a full like five senses experience like all of your five senses are senses are heightened in and tested and tried you know um and I appreciate his artistry it is massive and I really like Billy Joel like I almost want him to adopt me you know is that possible Anywho, y'all, 
I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Make sure you're subscribed and come back because, well, I'm cool. So why wouldn't you want to hang out with me? And uh, go and have the day that you deserve. Bye.